Imagine. Visualize. Dream. Welcome to a world of discovery. Imagine a paradise in your own backyard. Visualize the possibilities. Wherever your imagination takes you, SGM can make it happen. Adding a pool or a spa is one of the most exciting things you will do for yourself and your family. Your yard becomes a beautiful entertainment center and a healthier, happier place to be. Make your dreams a reality with SGM. For over 20 years, SGM has been the worldwide leader, producing the finest and most innovative maintenance-free products for swimming pools, spa, and deck finishes. Our mission is to achieve the highest quality standards in all aspects of our business operations, including manufacturing, marketing, research and development, and customer service. Hundreds of thousands of SGM pools have been built throughout the world, including major water theme parks, international resorts, competition arenas, and commercial and residential pools and spas. We always exceed industry standards to deliver the quality that you've come to expect from start to finish. We take a unique approach to help you get your installations done correctly, on time and on budget. Our extensive experience in the industry has given us the ability to recognize and serve the individual needs of our clients around the world. Our corporate headquarters and main manufacturing facility is in Pompano Beach, Florida with additional manufacturing and distribution facilities strategically located to serve our domestic and international markets. Each SGM plant utilizes the most highly developed state-of-the-art manufacturing techniques, computerized quality control methods, automated production, and extensive research and testing facilities. SGM offers a wide variety of quality products to meet every need of your installation process from beginning to end. Each product serves a specific purpose and is designed to give you the precise performance you need. For more information on our products and our company, you can visit us at our website at www.sgm.cc. SGM, the world leader in swimming pools, spa and deck finishes, proudly manufactures Durazo, a polished marble pool finish. Nothing makes your pool more beautiful than the shimmering finish of Durazo. And the beauty of Durazo isn't just on its surface. It's also extremely durable, comfortable, and easy to maintain. Durazo is a state-of-the-art, pre-blended pool finish designed to provide an exceptionally smooth, colorful, and long-lasting finish. Durazo's unique formulation of the whitest marble aggregates, highest quality color quartz, Portland cement, and performance-enhancing ad mixtures is an attractive alternative to traditional pool coatings. The result is a unique finish that is guaranteed to provide years of enjoyment. Durazo offers a selection of six sultry colors that are factory blended to perfection. Choose an individual color or combine two or more colors to create a unique blend that complements your poolscape. You can always count on SGM and Durazo for superior performance, exceptional durability, versatile design options, smooth, comfortable surface, and easy maintenance. SGM, a company dedicated to success. Surface preparation, new pool shells. New pool shells must be free of any foreign material that may interfere with the bonding of the new Durazo finish. All loose materials such as dripped thinset, grout, paint, dirt, sediment, patching, or decking products must be removed by scraping, water blasting, pressure cleaning, or sand blasting. Algae, mold, and mildew must be eliminated by chlorine washing. Failure to do so may result in discoloration and bond failure. Remove any oil or grease with trisodium phosphate in water. Oils and grease left on the pool shell will cause bond failure and prevent proper etching and cleaning by waterborne acid solutions. To test for oil and grease, wet the entire pool shell surface and examine it carefully for beading water droplets. Heavily saturated areas may require soaking with liquid detergents until the oil is removed. Etch the surface with a solution of muriatic acid in water. Adjust the concentration as needed to properly clean and etch the surface. 
Smoother shells will require a higher concentration of acid. Rinse, neutralize, and remove standing water. All water penetration due to hydrostatic pressure, weepers, must be stopped. Use SGM Dynamite pool patch to plug leaks and seal around fittings. The shell must be fully cured at least 28 days. All pool inlets and main drain lines should be plugged to prevent clogging during material installation and exposure. All plugs except the main drain should remain in place until the pool is filled to prevent drip stains. Mark the locations of all fittings with a small piece of tape placed on the coping directly above to prevent them from being accidentally covered. It is suggested to draw a plan indicating the locations of all fittings and projects with numerous inlets and outlets. Renovation Projects For renovation projects, you must undercut the existing substrate a minimum of two inches away from tile, fittings, discharge, lights, and main drain lines and three-eighths of an inch deep into the existing substrate. Sound out and remove all hollow and delaminated plaster. Identify the hollow spots and saw an area three inches outside the perimeter of the hollow spot. Remove the loose material inside the cut area. Fill the hollow, bringing the area level with the existing surface. Apply SGM bond coat as directed. Each unit of bond coat consists of one five-gallon pail of liquid resin and two 65-pound bags of dry mix and will cover approximately 500 square feet. Mix one 65-pound bag of SGM Bond Coat with a half pail of SGM Bond Coat liquid resin. Coat existing surface material using a one and one quarter inch nap paint roller. Allow material to set for approximately one minute. Then create stipple texture by going over the area again with a paint or texture roller. Allow Bond Coat to cure for at least 12 hours before applying Durazo. Mixing. Durazo is made in batches of approximately 4,000 to 8,000 pounds using a combination of natural mind and man-made ingredients. For this reason, there will be variations in shade between batches. Batch numbers are stamped on the ends of every bag. Separate the bags according to the batch numbers stamped on the bottom of each bag. Record all batch numbers. Blend different batches together in each mix according to the ratio present at the job site. For example, if there are 30 bags total on the job and there are 20 bags of batch A and 10 bags of batch B, then use two bags of A to one bag of B in every mix. Measure and add water to mixer. Hold back a portion of the water and add as necessary as mixing progresses. Careful measuring of the mix water will produce the best material. Lower water to cement ratios will produce plaster of greater strength and density. It is therefore best to use as little water as needed to produce a workable mix. Excess water will reduce strength and may result in shrinkage or check cracks. Water requirements will vary according to job site conditions and available raw materials. As a general rule, Durazo requires approximately one and a half to two gallons of water per bag of Durazo. Quality of the mix water is extremely important. Use clean, cool, potable water for mixing. Well water or water high in metal and mineral content may cause discoloration in the pool finish. Additionally, mixing water, which is very hard or of high alkalinity, will cause the surfacing material to effloresce, releasing high levels of salts that produce calcium scale. Check mix water for metals, minerals, hardness, and alkalinity before using. Add Durazo to water as quickly as possible to ensure that all the material has the proper mix time. Failure to do so will produce uneven set times resulting in washouts and streaking. Mix for a minimum of five minutes, but no longer than 10 minutes. This ensures even distribution of aggregates and increases the working time of the plaster. Insufficient mix time will result in uneven setting and shade variations. Too much mix time will produce an overall weaker finish and may entrain undesirable air bubbles. As a rule of thumb, mix for only the amount of time required to produce a consistent, homogeneous, lump-free consistency. Calcium chloride may be used as an accelerator. It must be fully dissolved in water, allowing impurities to settle out. Pour off the solution from the top, being careful not to add impurities to the mix. 
The impurities found in calcium chloride flake and pellets have been known to cause discoloration in pool finishes. No more than 2% by weight of cement, approximately a half pound per 80 pound bag, can be used. Overuse of calcium chloride will cause discoloration. Misting the shell. Mist the shell with cool, clean water, but do not leave any standing water. The substrate should be cool and damp, but not dripping wet. Standing water will weaken the Durazo finish in isolated areas and cause delamination. Hot, dry shells will cause rapid setting of the Durazo finish and may result in check or shrinkage cracking and delamination. Pumping. Although it's not necessary to use a plaster pump, many contractors choose to do so. Included here are some helpful hints for successful pumping. Prepare a slurry and run it through the pump first to prime the pump and lubricate the hoses. Next, pour the Durazo mixture slowly into the pump hopper. Do not pour all the material in at once. Agitate the material in the hopper to prevent separation of the cement and aggregates. Application. Apply a scratch coat to the bowl first. The bowl will set up last and it will be necessary to walk on the bowl during the exposure process. Beginning with the shady walls and working to the sunny walls, trowel a scratch coat on the walls and allow to set up slightly. The set time will vary according to temperature and humidity, so constant inspection of the Durazo finish during the application time is essential. Apply finish coat to the entire pool surface, working to a minimum of 3 eighths of an inch to 1 half an inch thick. Careful troweling will help to ensure even exposure, reduce washouts, and produce a comfortable slip-resistant finish. The technique of slick troweling is recommended. In this process, the cement paste is brought to the surface during troweling and is removed with the trowel. This produces a slick surface and minimizes your polishing efforts. Special attention must be given to filling in holes left by shoe spikes. The applicator must be careful to fill all spike holes with Durazo aggregate to avoid visible blemishes. Extra care must be taken to ensure proper troweling in the coves and corners. Insufficient troweling in these areas will result in roughness and washouts, loss of cement and aggregate, during the exposure process. Exposure. Allow the Durazo finish to dry overnight. The following day, begin by acid washing using a 25% solution of muriatic acid, higher concentrations may be needed for stubborn areas, and water to remove enough of the cement film remaining on the surface to see the color quartz aggregate. Increase the concentration of the acid solution as needed, being careful not to overexpose the finish. Start by washing the bowl first and work up to the shallow end. Acid wash the walls and steps last. Do not allow acid wash solution to puddle in the bowl area. Use a sump pump to constantly discard the runoff. Once you've completed acid exposing the Durazo surface, thoroughly rinse the entire surface and pump bowl dry. Polishing. Begin by polishing the walls first using a 70 grit diamond hone pan. Polish small areas and systematically work your way around the walls of the pool. Use caution while polishing so you do not scarify the tile, fittings, or other fixtures. Hand pads should be used around these areas. As you proceed, check the area polished with your hand to ensure no spots have been missed. Once the walls are complete, repeat the same process on the floor. Generally, one pass with a 70 grit diamond hone pad is sufficient to produce a smooth non-slip surface for most of the swimming pool. However, in high use areas such as swim outs, benches, and spa seats, it may be necessary to polish a second time using a 120 grit diamond hone pad. Continue using this technique until the entire finish has been polished. After the pool is complete and all surfaces are polished, wash down any remaining residue. Thoroughly rinse the entire surface and pump the bowl dry. Immediate filling of the pool will reduce any check cracking or crazing. In some instances, where curing conditions will allow, exposure and polishing may be done within four to six hours of installation of the Durazo finish. Startup and water balance. 
After the Durazzo finish has been polished, begin filling the pool. Care must be taken not to over dry the Durazzo finish, which may result in shrinkage or check cracking. There are no substitutes for experience and knowledge of local conditions in determining how long to let the Durazzo finish air dry. Pre-filter the water with a carbon tank and use a sequestering agent to eliminate stain-causing contaminants. Start the circulation system as soon as possible using the main drain line. Circulate the pool continuously for the first three days. On the first day, test and record chlorine, pH, total alkalinity, calcium hardness and temperature levels. Adjust pH to 7.2 to 7.4 and the total alkalinity to 100 ppm. Dissolve all chemicals in water first and allow sufficient time for each chemical to be fully dispersed before adding others. Do not add chlorine or calcium chloride. Brush the entire surface twice each day for the first three days. Clean the filter as needed. On the second day, record water testing and levels. Adjust pH to 7.2 to 7.4 and the total alkalinity to 100 ppm. On the third day, adjust all the chemistry to the noted levels. Free chlorine, 1.0 to 3.0 ppm. pH, 7.4 to 7.6. Total alkalinity, 90 to 120 ppm. Calcium hardness, 200 to 400 ppm. Stabilizer, 30 to 90 ppm. Maintenance. Lower calcium levels help to reduce scale and discoloration. Adjust the pump timer to normal operating hours. Do not install automatic pool cleaners for 28 days. Do not vacuum the pool with a wheeled vacuum for 14 days to avoid leaving wheel marks. Brush type vacuums may be used immediately. Brush pool walls and floor daily for the first two weeks. When you see this SGM Gold Seal, you can rest assured that you're using the highest quality product available today that is supported by our warranty program. It's a sign of our commitment to achieve the highest quality standards in all our swimming pools and spas. SGM, your single source manufacturer of installation systems for swimming pools, spas, and deck finishes. By following these steps in this video, you can protect and extend the beauty of every pool you install. Win referrals. Add to your revenues. Enhance reputation. Add to your professional image. No matter what the surface, SGM is a solid foundation you can build on. For more information about SGM, Diamond Bright, River Rock, or Durazzo, call 1-800-641-9247 or contact your local swimming pool professional.